well, the Panamanian Flute Festival is a festival where um, the students come and every, uh, during one week they enjoy flute performances and they learn all about the flute. So there were uh, lots of kids from Panama, the host country, uh, where I'm from and Daphne is, and there were lots of groups of students from Costa Rica and Honduras. Those were, I believe, the biggest groups of uh, students that were not Panamanian, but there were others too from the region, from Central America, mm -hmm. and even uh, some Colombian, I don't know if students, but at least faculty. That as teachers, we're trained to teach our DMA students to be sort of the most, um, you know, esteemed professional artists, right? To play at the top of their level, um, but not necessarily to do these entrepreneurial kinds of things or also these service projects. Like this project was a service. She's changing the community by doing this. This is way beyond, you know, playing your scales really, really fast or learning the hardest concerto from memory. This goes way beyond that. This big project that Daphne leaded was definitely one of the biggest in the region uh, regarding flute festivals and uh, us as Latin American students know that we don't really get as many opportunities to be able to listen and uh, uh, be able to learn from these great mentors and artists. Mm -hmm. And there's all over the Central America and South America, they've had these festivals, but they've never had anything in Panama. So this is really remarkable that Daphne was able to put this together to really serve the students of this country. Yeah, this is the first event that we organized after 113 years of Republican country in Panama. So before that, we never had anything like this. Mm -hmm.